case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1972 case, Dorton v. Collins and Aikman Corp., the United States Court of Appeals for the Sixth Circuit examined the dispute between the Carpet Mart, a carpet retailer in Tennessee, and Collins and Aikman, a carpet manufacturer in New York. The Carpet Mart claimed that Collins and Aikman deceived them by selling carpets that were not manufactured with the promised materials and sought $450,000 in damages. Collins and Aikman attempted to send the dispute to arbitration based on an agreement on the back of their sales acknowledgement forms. However, the district court denied their motion for a stay stating that there was no valid agreement. The court ruled that the district court had to investigate if the parties had an arbitration agreement based on their sales transaction procedures under TCA Section 47.2.207, UCC Section 2.207. If further findings determined that the arbitration provision became a contract term, Collins and Aikman's motion for a stay pending arbitration had to be granted, despite any fraud claims. This case highlighted the importance of additional terms in a contract and their binding nature if the parties agree to them or they do not materially alter the contract. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.